So here's a whole list, right? Decrease the number of times you say no. If you say no as a parent, especially preteens and teens, you better have a darn good reason, because they hear it all the time. I say to parents, here's a suggestion. Get your preteens and teens to convince you why you should say yes. That's how you promote responsibility. You know, I hear what you're saying. You want to go to the dance. You're only 11 years old. Why don't you go to your room, drop a plan, let mom and dad or mom and mom or whoever in the house hear it and, and convince us. Where are you going to be? What time are you going to be? This is how we develop responsibility. So often we usurp that, that opportunity by saying no without even thinking about it. Right? Does that make sense? So when you're looking at these things and go, I don't know if I can do that, go back to those first two slides. What do you want for your youth and what do you want for your relationship with them? And if, you know, see how that works together? You don't need me for that. But you better, you know, teenagers here, and preteens especially, it's like in that like preteen zone, hear two things too much. One is wait, and the other one is no. And if we can minimize those things, we're gonna have less conflict with them. Okay, is that helpful, folks? Yes? So if you get them to draw a plan, you can always say no, but you're developing responsibility, right? You're talking it out, you're, you're, you're discussing it. You're also building a relationship. Maybe you're sitting over hot chocolate or you're going for a slush and you're, you're building the relationship while they're demonstrating their ability. They might come up with a really great idea. That you, the amazing thing is uh, teenagers and preteens and even children, like small children, are more capable than we even know. But they're often not given the chance to demonstrate that to us. So the sooner we can start demonstrating that, the sooner they can demonstrate, hey, this is not a bad plan. If that's what it's about. If it's about something else, we have to be honest about that. Like they come up with a great plan and you say no anyway, you've got to reconcile that with yourself and with them. 